Good morning. It's me, Mikey Pipes. <laughs> Monday, August 15th, 2022. A little before 10 o'clock in the morning. It's getting a little quiet with the uh, service calls, but we have a bunch of installs, especially one tomorrow. But it is 74 degrees here in Valley Stream, New York which is on Long Island in Nassau County. Got a great week ahead. Heading to South Carolina Wednesday night. Coming back Friday. Got to do some more license work. Trying to get, grab up as much as I can down there. So, K Plumbing and Mikey Pipes can offer true home services. It's going to be epic. It's going to be epic. And hopefully I get to meet my uh, new hire, potentially new hire. It's going to be nice, guys. It's going to be nice. But anyway, we're going to a service call in Valley Stream. A new client, at least that I'm aware of. They have no cooling. So let's go give them some cooling. Let's give them some cooling. Let's do it now. <laughs> Smash that thumbs up button. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe. Thank you in advance. And as always... Thoughts, feedback, and criticism, you know where they go. Down in the comments section down below. I do my best to try to reply to most, if not all. And if you're saying something wise at your at your pie hole, I'm just gonna block you and I may call you some profanity along the way. So be kind guys. Alright, let's get going! Good morning. Good morning. Here for the air conditioning. Hi, uh, hi. You guys are quick. I just got off the phone with her first. That was around the corner. Oh, I was like, whoa. That was quick. Cool. How are you? Is that, does the old lady still live over there? Oh, well, she passed away. Oh, I haven't heard from the family in a while. Over, like, what, four months ago? A couple months ago? Uh, yeah. Normally we're there every. Uh, yeah, it hasn't been that long. This guy just it's sold a, the house. They're in and out. I think they're fixing it. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's original. A, yeah. She's old. I know. Like yeah. 90 God something. I know. Yeah. I think she, she had, I think the last time I spoke to the nurse's age, she was 98. Wow. She was old. Because I was like, bless her. Yeah. Wow. Then one day I just started seeing moving trucks. I'm like, she must have passed. Same thing Seven. with the guy in the corner. This whole block was seniors. <laughs> it really was. It's like one by one. But anyway, What's I two here? systems. Okay. Upstairs not working? Yeah. What's it doing? It's just profanity. It's not cooling. That happened to me a while back, and the guy told me it was a fuse. I'm hoping it's the same issue. All right, let's go to the thermostat and the filter, yeah. and then we'll uh, check everything else. Let's we'll put in the obvious things first. The one downstairs is working, but okay. I might as well check it. One of these is the filter. I, I, yeah, the filter needs changing, obviously. Yeah, you have a new filter? Uh, I gotta check the garage. I probably do. I'm okay. Sure. Mommy, look at filter in the garage, no? Probably not that change it. All right, we'll have to take it out. Where's the thermostat? Oh, right. Okay. I turned it off. Yeah, okay. I Googled. It. it said to turn it yes. off if it's not cooling. Let's see what it does. All right, so the blower works. That's a good thing. Oh, no, no, it does. That works. It just stopped. I was watching TV. I'm like, why am I sweating? And I was up to 82 up here yesterday. <laughs> Let me take a so peek up in the attic. The light switch is on. Let me go through I think I'll hit you in the head. <laughs> Normally I just pull it up a little bit so it. Uh, <laughs> right, I just want to take a peek and make sure nothing is disconnected, make sure nothing's out of the ordinary. Yeah, the lights are on the left. Okay. And then we'll check that and side. And they see the back behind you. Okay. Light switch on the left. Right Bingo. Okay. Oh. Nice new clean system, no water in the pan. Okay, so you have gas heat off of it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, the gas flex. All right, let's go outside. Where's the fuse box? There's so there's a, there's, um, now when you say fuse, when you say fuse to me, I think. I installed it because my son, my kids, he loves to switch it on and off. Like, and he's like, 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 he's like,
Uh. Said probably. So I don't know if that's what happened again. Okay. I normally do that. Oh, perfect. And then, uh, and then it's there, and you can like Push just pull on it, and then it pulls oh, down for you. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I've been doing it for a few days. Yeah. You said you had mentioned fuse. So there's a fuse inside the unit, and if the fuse blows, mm -hmm. you'll have nothing. Oh, you have no fan, no nothing. Oh, okay, so now you also have circuit breakers. I checked the circuit breakers. First thing I did. Let's go check them anyway. I don't know why I did. Let's go check them anyway. All right. So here, here is out, outside compressor. Now, sometimes it'll look like it's still on, but it's actually in the middle and it's off. Uh, okay. So you have to turn it off and then oh, turn I it back on. I didn't do that one. I did this one. Which one? Oh, second floor air handler. So that's on and that's on. So now we go outside. Everything else looks to be appears to be on. Yeah, there's yep. some checking. I did that Good. yesterday. Okay. Nice little corner lot. Yeah. All right, so here are the two units. Do we know which one's first floor to the second floor? Oh, this is the second floor. Okay. The big ones go down. And so we'll, take, we'll go inside here. Let's pull that out. Right. Now, is that really a dryer vent? Yeah. What do you think happens when the air conditioning is on and the dryer is on? Where do you think all the lint goes? In there? Yeah. Let's see. And if you take a closer look, she is coated with dirt and dust and lint. So. The AC came before the dry lint. So. <laughs> I, I hear you. be on this side. <laughs> so I moved the laundry on this side. Uh, just based on what I heard so far it sounds like the compressor is not on okay so i'm gonna get some tools we'll figure out why that's not on okay. it's probably a simple fix okay. probably mm -hmm. but at a minimum when i take the cover off to look i want to make we got we need to see how much dirt is on here and we're probably well, going to want to move the laundry i know you, well yes you can actually <laughs> you can technically you can i, don't want to. I know you don't want to <laughs> i just moved it i just did this like two they just drilled a hole there yeah and it took hours to drill mm -hmm. through that hours upon hours mm -hmm. and a big bill probably mm -hmm. but <laughs> why didn't any any reason why didn't they put it here instead i don't know or I why didn't they know. like drill up higher where they could have not drilled through I don't know. I okay let me grab the tools i see you have a gate right there yeah. and we'll see what's going on All with right, it you're welcome Come on with this one. No compressor. Okay. Let's take this cover. That's it. <laughs> That's it. That's it. That's it. Capacitor is a thirty-five-five. Let's take a look at the. Okay. That's good. Also good. Let's take a look at this coil. Yeah. Filthy. Hair and lint. Wow. Let's see. A lot of mulch. Wow. <laughs> a lot of mulch here. Damn. Yeah, way too much. get this cover off okay. screw there screw here Take this off and test it. 
Common and Herm. Uh, kind of. Okay. A little more complicated than that. So, common and fan, five. So, she's dead. Need a new capacitor. Need to take care. So, with the... So, what's the solution? That's what we need. That's a great answer. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, to... But I want to educate you a little bit. Okay. Because an educated... Like, you remember Sims back in the day? Yes. The clothing store, educated consumer yeah. is their best customer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the more you know, okay. even though it's worthless information, the better yeah. it is. Okay. So you had said it used to cool faster, better before. Yeah. Faster and better before, right? Yeah. So air conditioning takes heat from the heat house and brings it outside. Right. And it brings it outside with the refrigerant. In this case, it's Puron, doesn't use Freon. But mm -hmm. nonetheless, the heat gets released outside. This, this car radiator looking thing or this coil is where it should be getting rid of and the fan helps it get rid of it. So if there's dirt on the coil or this car radiator, you know, the car is going to overheat yeah. and it's not going to cool okay. the way it should. So okay. the easiest way of doing this, mm -hmm. I'm saying easiest because it's the easiest way, okay. not the right way or the, mm -hmm. or the way it should be done is that we just take some water and we clean it from inside out, leave the covers on and hope for the best. I hope we get most of it off. The right way and the... This is a little more expensive. More expensive. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. I mean, this is my time yeah. to sugarcoat it, but mm -hmm. if I, I, I wanted to remove all the mulch from the bottom, because if I can remove the screws, I could take off this whole cover here. It's like a U and put it off to the side and we could brush it off and we could clean it, we can chemically clean it and it'd be fine. Okay, how much is that? I mean, look that up. Okay. And also, is yes. something, because I don't want to move the vent. What do I put? All right, so I'm using the old capacitor. Just elevate it up a little bit off the pad and away from the mulch, just so I can get to the screws in the bottom. And then we'll take the whole cover off because you can see she's wearing multiple fur coats here. It's a little trick for me. If I had some block, I'd raise it up, but we're still limited by the line set penetration, so can't go up on all sides. It's completely elevated, but this is what I'm working with. All right. Let's just put this off to the side. Let's take a look. A lot of build up there. You know, if, this, if there was a coil in the back part, that would be filthy covered. But look at all that. Whew, wow. That's a lot. So I'm going to brush it off, put the covers back on, and then do a rinsing. And that's primarily because I don't want to be working with mud while I'm reassembling the cover. I just don't want to do it. You know, it's a cleaner job, too. But I'm going to take a brush, brush all that off, and then use the... Uh, refrigeration technologies, coil cleaner, coil brightener, and restore this coil back to life. Take a look at this. Wow, it's crazy. See that? Wow. I had to pause to take a thumbnail picture. Wow, that is crazy. Wow. I gotta move that dryer vent. But I took a look inside the inside the laundry room and finished walls, built-in cabinets. Not gonna be easy. I gotta get a bucket and take all the debris out of here. Wow. Look at that. Wow. Crazy, huh? Linton. Hair. Insane. Wow. But she's much better now. Alright, I got the coil clean now. As you can see, it's brand new for the win. The Titan HD 35.5. My, one of my oranges going into common were a little loose, so I just took my needle nose, tightened them up. So my two oranges going on common, my brown on fan. Sorry purple on Herm, which is hermetically sealed compressor. So oranges, in this particular case, they were on C, they're back on C, which is common. Brown is on fan. We're gonna put the condenser fan motor cover back on top, fire up, hope for the best. All right, here goes nothing. Come on, bad boy. Like magic. Love hearing that hum. There we have it.
have it. The rude, rude boy lives another day. Now, you're asking about the other system. The other system, not as bad, but she could use a cleaner. She could use a cleaner. I got a, I got a very busy schedule today. I got to meet the, an inspector for a final inspection in about 48 minutes. And you know they're never going to show up on time. <laughs> but it's a village, so maybe they'll show up exactly at 1030. I got the other mic setting up a pressure gauge for a final inspection. We're doing a, we did a steam replacement job there, but setting up the pressure gauge. And uh, hopefully everything's good. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you ain't testing, you're guessing. Don't overlook the obvious. All right, we had a dirty condenser fan coil. That's going to affect performance. That's going to increase the electric bill. And that's going to cause them to have an uncomfortable house. Thanks so much for watching. Be well. God bless. Stay safe.